Uh, we next have uh, Nitya Shetty from iSoda Up. So Nitya is going to tell us about what is iSoda. Okay, as the name suggests, it's not iSoda. And it's got nothing to do with the hospitality segment. <laughs> we just wanted to make it interesting, you know, because people think that the software industry people are very boring. So we thought we'll make it a little interesting. And we call it iSoda. Uh, no, uh, jokes apart, uh, iSoda, it stands for Infotech Software Dealers Association. And uh, this association was born out of the necessity of the tax complication which arises in our country. And uh, that prevalent time, this was uh, so association was born about five years back. And uh, we had a lot of challenges in terms of the TDS. And that's how this whole idea of the association was born. And uh, we've moved a lot ahead in this five years. We had a lot of successes, like the TDS was removed uh, because of the uh, lobbying which we could do with the government as an association. And uh, this year we are working towards collaboration amongst uh, members. So we do a lot of collaborative business opportunities for the members, as well as we are still working on the taxes and we do other activities like some soft skill trainings also for the fellow members. So these are our objectives for this year. Thank you so much. They, we recently had Kiran Ajwani. Where's Kiran? Yeah, Kiran Ajwani spoke at iSoda. So if you're a good speaker and you can educate the software community, it's a very good opportunity to network and you know, uh, get so We have a quarterly uh, meeting in which all the iSoda members come. And uh, we are a national association. So we are spread through the country. So we have regional meets which happens in the north, south, east and west. And as part of our objective this year, we do call upon uh, some guest speakers for some soft skill trainings. So Kiran was uh, very kind enough to grace the occasion last time and Kiran spoke on finances because you know all the software owners are typically entrepreneurs who've been some software engineers or sales guys and all you know who's become entrepreneurs and started their own software companies. So there are a lot of skills which are missing in them and we realize that you know we require a lot of soft skill trainings for that. So this initiative was towards that. So we're going to continue having such initiatives also. Thank you, Nitya. Thank you. Thank you so much.